so she tells me that she had to call all the the trumpet players and let them know that you know they hired somebody uh -huh. And she said she'd save me for last because she wanted to let me know that the band really, really liked me and that it was it was between me and the guy who got the gig. Okay. And the deciding factor was the fact that this guy had a resume that was a mile long. He okay. played with the Four Tops and Temptations, done all this touring and all okay. this stuff. My resume was literally one line. Okay. Ten years with the Navy band. Okay. That was it. I get you. I had no touring experience, right. no recording experience, nothing. Okay. But I played my ass off in the okay. audition. So um, what ended up happening was, I, I, like I said, I got out of the Navy. I toured with Maynard Ferguson's band for a year. Um, and then the, uh, the trumpet player that they ended up hiring, uh, he decided he wanted to move on and, and explore some other things. And they called me and they said, hey, what have you been doing for the last you know, year and I said, Well, I got out of the Navy and I've been touring with Maynard Ferguson's band. Perfect. And they wow. were like, That's fantastic. Great. You want to join Tower of Power? I was like, Done. <laughs> yeah. Yep. That's so great. That's how that happened. And I uh, January, That's almost better. It's almost you know, better it really that like is. that like you were like you were there. You were like there to get the gig because you deserved it. But at the same time it was just like it wasn't your time yet in the sense of like just like I don't know. It's almost just perfect that that's how it went down because you ended up going to do what you're what you're already qualified to do, and they, you know. But the fact that like you just ended up doing that anyways, and then this, the stars aligned. Like this is what we were just talking about. Like yeah. the stars just aligned, and then like oh, just call. This is perfect. He's been on tour. Like I don't know. That's just great. And not only that, but I mean, of course, being a, a trumpet player, especially being a high note trumpet player. Right. You know, I mean, Maynard Ferguson was like one of my main idols growing up. Okay. And, you know, he, he was already, I think he was 78 or 79 by the time I joined the band. Okay. So I was in one of the last trumpet sections that, that he had. And, and uh, you know, I just feel so blessed and so grateful that I had that opportunity to, and I learned so much from, from him. Like, what, what, are some, what are some things that, like, what was it like? And, like, what did you, how did you learn things and what did you learn? And like, well, you know, it's interesting because that's actually something I've been thinking about a lot lately. Um, you know, Maynard wasn't. He couldn't really explain what it was he did. Okay. You know, and so his, he didn't really, he, as far as like the physical part of playing trumpet, mm -hmm. he couldn't really, you know, and, and we never really asked him like, you know, tr typical trumpet geek questions. Okay. Like, hey man, how do you play the high G at the end? You know, the, you just didn't <laughs> you just ask didn't Maynard do... that kind right, of right. stuff. You I know? see what you're saying. Because everything he did was, was like just... It was just him. It was just a part of him. Mm -hmm. You know, it was, it's hard to explain, but it yeah. was just, it wasn't, you know, he wasn't thinking about the physical aspect of the trumpet at all. He okay. never did. You know, it was just, it was, it was just his being, his, his spirit, you know, his extension it, of him, an extension of his, of his soul right. uh, and of his physical, physical body. Um, all right. If you liked the video, please uh, go ahead and subscribe and hit the like button. A lot of my uh, viewers are are not subscribed to the channel, so uh, I always get people asking me what's the best way to support Electric Louie Land. And to be honest, uh, the best way is to go and subscribe to the YouTube channel. So uh, do that and uh, share a video and tell your friends. So uh, thank you guys for watching.